what is contemporary art? Contemporary art is art made by the daily living artist. As such, it reflects the complex issues that shape our diverse, global, and rapidly changing world. A reference to contemporary art, meaning the art of the day, may broadly include artwork produced during the late 20th and 21st century. It generally defines art produced after the modern art movement to the present day. However, modern art is not just art produced during a specific time frame. This genre of art does have its own approach or style that distinguishes it from others. Yet, this style of art is difficult to define because it includes such variety. Some argue that the basic approach and goal of modern art is to challenge the nature of art itself. It can also make the viewers question what is it that defines art. Therefore, this style of art is not particularly uniform, and it may be more challenging to precisely describe than any other genre of art. Additionally, there are several major reasons why contemporary art is important to society. For instance, it is a means to express oneself and it is the way to provide social and cultural commentary. What is the history of contemporary art? Contemporary art is initially grow along with modernism. However, it is now viewed as the divergent from that school. In 1910, Roger Fry and his colleague found the Contemporary Art Society. At the time, this was simply a private society where artwork could be purchased for public museums. Through the 1930s, more institutes were founded with the same terminology. Scholar in the field distinguished modern art as a unique style that did align with a specific time. In contrast, the contemporary style continued to progress over time, which led to the wide variety of approach and outcomes. Feminist art, art that seeks to continue the dominance of men in both art and society to gain recognition and equality for women artists and question assumption about womanhood. Beginning the 1960s and the 1970s, feminist artists use a variety of medium including painting, performance art, and craft historically considered. Women's work, a quick work that aimed to end sexism on oppression and exposed femininity to be a masquerade a set of poses adopted by women to confirm our societal expectations. While many of the debates inaugurated in these decades are still ongoing, a younger generation of feminist artists takes an approach incorporating intersecting concern about race, class, form of privilege, and gender identity and fluidity. But feminism and feminist art continue to evolve. Feminist art is a category of art associated with the late 1960s and the 1970s feminist movement. Feminist art highlights the societal and political difference women experience within their lives. The hopeful thing from this form of art is to bring positive understanding of things to the world in the hope to lead the equality or liberation. Media use range from traditional art forms such as painting to more orthodox methods such as performance art, conceptual art, body art, activism, video film, and fiber art. Feminist art has served as an innovation driving force towards expanding the definition of art through the incorporation of new media and a new perspective. Historically speaking, women artists when they existed have largely faded in the obscurity. There is no female Michael Angelo with the BJ equivalent. In why have there been no great women artists? 
in the not steam road. The fourth life, not in our stars, our hormones, our menstrual cycles, or our empty internal spaces, but rather our institute and our education. Because of women's historical role as caregivers, most women were unable to devote their time to creating art. In addition, women are often not allowed to attend art school or take nude painting classes for fear of impropriety. Therefore, women who were artists were most wealthy and had spare time, which were trained by their father or uncle and produced still lifes, landscape, and portrait works. Feminist art can be continuous to define as it holds different personal and political elements different from everyone. There have been misguided theory of the nature of art. Lucy R. Leppard stated in 1980 that feminist art was neither a style nor a movement but instead of value system, a revolutionary strategy, a way of life. Emerging at the end of 1960s, the feminist art movement was inspired by 1916 student protests, the civil rights movement, and the second wave of feminism. By critiquing institutions that promote sexism and racism students that are people of color, and women were able to identify and attempt fix inequity. Women artists use their artwork to protest collectives and women art registry to shed light on inequities in the art world. The first wave of feminist art was established in the mid-19th century. In the early 1920s, with the women gaining the right to vote in the America, the liberalization wave spread through the world. The slow and gradual change in feminist art started gaining momentum in the 1960s. The feminist art movement refers to the efforts and accomplishment of feminists internationally to produce art that reflects women's life and experiences, as well to change the foundation of the production and perception of contemporary art. It also pushes to bring more visibility to women within art history and creative practice. By the way, it expresses the visuals, the inner thought, and objective of the feminist movement to show to everyone and give meaning to the art. It helps construct the role of those who continue to undermine the mainstream and of the masculine native of the art world. Corresponding with general developments within feminism and often include such self-organization tactics as the Consciousness Rising Group. The movement began in the 1960s and flourished throughout the 1970s as an outgrowth of the so-called the second wave of feminism. It has been called the most influential international movement of any during the post-war period. The 1960s was a period when women artists wanted to gain equal rights with men within the established art world and to create feminist art often in non-traditional way to help change the world.